I used to go to uh, some of the Tongan uh, traditional towns in some of the festival and I just want to sit and uh, learn, see how they do it and just come home and uh, practice um, a lot and get to learn. I, there's no one um, uh, teach me how to do, to do it, but I just create it myself. Because being a faculty, it's more creative in Tonga. I've been dreaming for a um, long time ago for the crown of the Miss Galaxy. And there's some contestants that I knew for sure that they are doing a, a good job as well. This year, I'm, I'm not afraid of anything or even care about. I just do my own and be myself. And I have to struggle for my dream and my code. That's it. My mom um, used to teach me to uh, help her in um, doing the washes, cooking, and, and weaving the Tongan mats, how to decorate it. Because all of my sisters, they are married and they take their own family, you know. It's, uh, but I count it, it's a, a one way of help to my mom. I don't care why some other people, they look at me and, you know, the Tongan family, they see me doing some girl stuff or even women's um, work, but it doesn't matter for myself as long as I help my mom. This is my third time joining the Miss Galaxy. So I'm experiencing a um, lot of stuff and uh, how to put on makeup. stuff for the lunch um, so we can do our, our island island Tongan food when I was uh, young I'm a I just act like a boy I just act like a boy but uh, um, when I was 15 I was trying to wear clothes like a girls yeah I will trust this I just show it to you guys later <laughs> Last week I met with him and he invited me to go and have a dinner with him at, uh, together with his family. 
and I was surprised to myself. I'm already for lady. <laughs> I'm already for lady, and um, and the guy was said, "Oh, Cookie, you know what? I like you." And I said, "Are you real? Are you serious?" And he's, and he said, "Yeah, I'm serious." And the guy was said, "Oh, um, can I kiss you?" At the same time, I, I was thinking to myself, "This is the first time for me." And the guy will touch my lips, and he kissed me. For him, he already told me um, we gonna we gonna marry. But I said uh, when, and he said, "Oh, uh, we can talk about it. In here, we can we cannot allow to marry man with man." But in New Zealand, and they are allowed. Uh, if I live here with another man, I think the, the village will look down on me. But I, I was thinking to myself, it's my choice. I don't want to tell to my family if I tell them, because my mom is fine. But my dad's side, maybe they will find me to kill me or whatever. Not kill, just maybe they mad of me and they hate me. I heard the Bible said, if you're going to marry, just leave your family, just stick to your wife or husband. On Sunday, I call for that church, but sometimes I stay home. Sleepy. One day uh, she came from school, she dressing um, a tahine clothes. <laughs> then my dad, he was Then <laughs> <laughs> Matthew, uh, she was crying, and after that she told to my mom. Um, she liked to wear um, um, ladies uh, clothes and that, so we can't stop her. When Amati was 11 years old, he started when uh, he went to school. He came straight from school and went to um, another place uh, near to my house. It's a faculty there. And when she went to school, she came straight from school to that house. It's a faculty there. And she started uh, in the afternoon time when she after half and that she starts uh, to paint the face and lipstick and also wear the the girl's clothes. Uh, we're doing the table center for the for the royal luncheon for tomorrow. Table pieces, we haven't finished with those. This has to be on the table. Plates, uh, knife and forks. We have to set every table. I have I am, um, one, 250, so I just left 50. <laughs> Do we have enough? Okay. No. It's not a candle. Only two candles. I think I've got everything for love. For love. I think I'm going to be a Eva. I'm going to be a Eva. I'm going to be a Eva. I'm going to drop me. What's the name?
about 140, 50. Well, there's nothing in Tonga. Unless you want to bring a four-seater. <laughs> Unfortunately, your grandfather didn't make tables, so, you know. <laughs> it is tradition that on his coronation, it is his day, and we try and make sure that we, um, that he, that everybody knows that he is the king. You know, he's the ruler, he is everything, he's the father of the country. We're proud of him, you know, of our monarchy, and we love the royal family. Thank you.